So uh, my fiance proposed. We had been uh, we both went to the University of Vermont together. Um, we met our freshman year. Um, didn't really start dating until our sophomore year um, of college. Um, this past summer, and we'd been dating since college, so um, for about ten years. Um, this past summer, I had an opportunity to go back to the University of Vermont for a professional conference and was there and was actually staying in residence halls, which is pretty ironic um, to be back there. We had planned a trip to see um, my fiance's family in New Hampshire and he came up um, early to UVM, had been back for a while, um, and after the conference ended he decided to kind of take me around or walk around the campus. I said, do you want to see places? You know, I've been here for a couple days so I've kind of seen it. Um, and he's like, yeah, let's go here. We first um, ended up uh, walking through the bookstore, kind of made our way up this side of this fire escape that we always climb up. It's a wonderful views of the lake and the mountains. Um, later did I find out that he was too nervous to impose on this rickety fire escape, so we moved on from there, went into a chapel that was on campus. Um, there were people in there who felt a little, a little awkward, like he didn't want to propose there, so we kept going. This is all something I found out later. Um, we then ended up at the main mountain on the University Green, um, and he kind of uh, got me into taking a picture of him, I'll take a picture of you, and when he was on one knee, then he was fumbling around in his pocket. I'm like, oh, is your phone ringing? I had no idea. Um, you know, had always kind of been playing that out in my mind, like when, and then not getting my hopes up. And then I kind of realized and then was a complete mess. I was just, you know, bawling. He, he was getting emotional, and he, um, you know, he had this very sincere poem that he had written. He's an English teacher, so he definitely knows the, the written word very well, and um, it was just really special. Like, there was really no one around. It was just kind of our moment, and we had a great time and got to actually share the news with family um, that we were going to see the next day. So, that's it.